Hi, it's really a challenge to find the best products that can be deserving of your hard-earned money. It may be easier when you have a reliable source like our channel. Actually, our team reviewed a lot of products, analyzed endless reviews from the actual users, and made our rankings based on many factors, such as price, quality, durability, performance, and the reputation of the manufacturer. If you choose from this list, you can be sure that you're buying one of the best products. You can see their latest prices and find out more information about these products by using the links below in the description. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Okay, so let's get started with the video. Are you looking for the best bypass loppers for pruning tree limbs and branches in your budget? Well, in today's video we break down the top 5 best bypass, loppers for pruning tree limbs and branches. Starting at number 5, we have the Spear and Jackson Ratcheting Anvil Lopper. When you need something more substantial for cutting extra tough branches and growth and a basic anvil lopper won't do, then the extra power from a ratcheting mechanism may be what's called for. This ratcheting anvil lopper from Spear and Jackson has a whole host of features that makes light work of cutting back even dead, woody branches in high up or hard to reach places. As with the Tabor anvil above, they are made from lightweight aluminum and weigh in just a little heavier at 1.5 kilograms. They do offer telescopic handles that extend from 18 inches up to 28 inches and can be adjusted with a simple twist and lock action mid-cut. I've found this to be a really useful feature when cutting back the various different areas of my yard from trees to shrubs to bushes, it's all possible given the varying lengths available with this lopper. Okay, so you're not going to be able to cut branches with any greater diameter than 1.5 inches but they are great when faced with dead, woody branches in high up or hard to reach places thanks both to the ratcheting housing that combines additional leverage with more force. I also find that overall, the ratchet style lopper decreases the risk of tatty looking cuts and is certainly more precise. Moving on at number 4. We have the Fiskars Powerstep L85 Anvil Lopper. The Fiskars Powerstep L85 Anvil Lopper is a powerhouse tool that is versatile enough to work well for both right and left handed users. Manufactured using precision stainless steel, these measure 57 cm in length and weigh in at 680 grams making them the lighter of our two anvil loppers options. In terms of performance, they have a hook-shaped counter blade which means branches are securely held in place as you lop. These are intended for use specifically for dry and dead branches of up to 4 cm, 1.5 inches, in diameter making them ideal for cutting back small to mid-sized growth. But, when you do encounter slightly thicker branches that don't want to budge, these have a cleaver step mechanism that allows you to trim branches in two or three steps and allow for greater leverage without using excessive amounts of force. I've been using these loppers now for over 12 months and I am impressed with the smooth and precise cutting that comes with loppers that are fitted with a hardened steel blade. I've not had to sharpen them yet and there are absolutely no signs of rust either. Click here for Fisker's Power Step Anvil Loppers. At number 3, we have the Fisker's 32-inch Power Gear Bypass Lopper. What do you get when you put gears on a giant scissors? Well, you get the Fisker's Power Gear Bypass Loppers for pruning through tree limbs and branches. With the Fisker's Power Gear Bypass Lopper, you get a premium cutting tool which gives you the ability to cut tree branches up to 2 inches in diameter with slick and smooth cutting action. Fisker's employs their patented Power Gear technology on this lopper which multiplies your effort three times to make cutting through those branches and twigs even easier than you think. It comes equipped with 32-inch handles which gives you more leverage to reach farther tree branches, and also decreases the effort you need to apply to make the cut. A fully hardened steel blade ensures that the blade doesn't get dull after a few cuts and can withstand heavy use. The blade is also coated as well to reduce friction when making cuts, as well as protect against rusting. If you're really in need of a good bypass lopper to do some serious pruning in your garden, then the Fisker's Power Gear 2 Bypass Lopper is definitely one you should consider. Lest I forget, the handles are rubberized to ensure that you have a good soft grip on the tool while using it. At number 2, we have the Corona Dual Link Telescoping Bypass Lopper. 
the Corona Dual Link Bypass Lopper gives you the capacity to cut through limbs as small as 3 quarters inch in size and as large as 1 inch in size. With its extendable or telescoping arms feature, you get to be able to reach far higher branches with the lopper. Just flip open the red thingy on the handles to release the handles and extend them, and flip back to lock down the handles and you can start using the lopper. Without extending the handles, they are 27 and a half inches in length, but after extending them you get a length of 37 and a half inches. That is an extra 10 inch increase in length, affording you more leverage to reach more limbs and branches from your position. The Corona Dual Link Bypass Lopper makes use of their power source linkage system which is a kind of lever system that helps reduce how far you open the arms and also multiplies the effort you apply to make cutting with it a lot more easier. Corona also employs a shock guard bumper system which helps reduce the snapping action of the jaws after cutting hence reducing user fatigue. The Corona Dual L Ink Bypass Lopper is definitely one of the best ones you should look to when you need a lopper which can afford you more leverage when pruning with it. And finally at number 1. We have the Tabor Tools GG11 Bypass Lopper. The Tabor Tools GG11 Compound Action Bypass Lopper as the name implies makes use of a compound lever system for making cuts. The compound lever system has multiple pivot points which all work in unison to reduce the efforts needed from the operator, by multiplying the little applied force to increase the force applied to the blade. All this makes it very easy to cut with the GG11 Compound Action Bypass Lopper. With it you can cut through 3 quarters inch thick branch without any trouble. Even after heavy use, the blades remain sharp as it is made with hardened carbon still. It's coated with a non-stick which makes the blade slide through cuts effortlessly. A 30 inch length handle makes it easy not only for you to reach higher branches and twigs, but also affords you some extra strength as it increases your effort and helps makes cutting a lot more easier. The tool ergonomics is also on point as the handles are rubberized with soft grip rubbers which makes it easy to hold the tool firmly and steadily. Overall, the GG11 Compound Action Bypass Lopper is great pruning tool. In terms of quality it's well made with hardened carbon steel blades, cuts efficiently within the advertised tree branch sizes, and it's definitely one of the best bypass loppers you can equip yourself with right now. Thank you for watching guys, I hope you like this video. If this video was helpful to you, please make a sure like, comment, subscribe.